Okay, I'm not going to have time because of all that's been happening to go through the painting with you concerning this. It's just not going to be feasible right now. But here he is painted, and it's a simple, this is a simple project. I didn't want to, for beginners, I, this Christmas, I didn't want to make something too difficult uh, showing you how the head was. As you can see, I, I just painted the, the uh, body red and the white collars. The boots, of course, are black with the flesh tone and uh, an off-white for, uh, for the beard. And basically, it's a, it, like I said, it's a simple project, and I antiqued it, and a lot of red around the face uh, for uh, the Santa and the sleepy eyes, in other words. He's sort of a little sleepy-eyed Santa. But it's not a difficult project. I didn't want it to be difficult. I'm trying to make projects as simple as possible uh, for this Christmas for you, for those that are beginning and starting out. And as we go along, I know we're going to get into some more difficult projects, but right now, this is a simple little Santa that we're doing. So, uh, the painting is relatively simple. Get you some flesh tone, some off-white, uh, or some cream white, some black, and some red, and you've got your Santa painting. And, of course, I, I dunked him in the antiquing solution. So he's just a little, he's a little something that you can have for your Christmas, and uh, it's a good little project. It really is. I've got a number of things going on right now, but um, I'm sorry I couldn't go through the painting with you, but just if you, if you want to refer back to the, the wizard and other things like that, and as you see, most of the painting for these projects, there's not a lot of uh, difference in them. So here's our little project. And he was a lot of fun to do, and he's real simple. He's not not real difficult to do. And um, uh, I'd like to get in one more project before Christmas comes, uh, perhaps uh, similar to the wizard project, but a a little uh, stick or something like that, maybe a little snowman or something like that. But here's our little project. It's all painted up, and most of you, like I said by now, have already known or observe me painting. It's, it's not a difficult process, but uh, it's just you'll learn more as you go along. So this is our little Santa. This is our little uh, uh, big-headed Santa. And um, he's finished. And as you can see, I'm, I'm doing this for a, <laughs> I'm doing this for a uh, friend. Uh, for his fiance, he just now he's getting married, and his fiance wants some Santa Clauses, so I've um, got this project going right now. But one day we'll get into something a little bit more difficult like this. But for right now, we want to concentrate on beginners and people who haven't carved a long time uh, and doing things. So anyway, there's our little project, and I listen. I appreciate uh, you going through the carving with me. And I hope I didn't disappoint you by not going through the painting. But like I said, all you have to do is refer to the other paint jobs that I did, and it's pretty much self-explanatory. The same thing with this. I'm just painting your beard and your clothes and your, your boots and everything like that. And that's, uh, that's the little project. I just wanted to kind of see what it looked like when it was through. And you don't have to go this color scheme. You can make this green or uh, whatever, the, the little suit, whatever you, you choose. But... But just have fun with it. The main thing is I want you to have fun with these projects. And uh, as we go, we'll get into more difficult projects. But right now, let's stay with uh, this year, mainly with um, more beginner stuff uh, that you can do. And I thank you so much and continue to pray for us down here. It's a madhouse, but uh, praise the Lord. He's taking care of us. Now, God bless you. And look, please wear your carving glove. Take care of yourself. And happy carving, and, and we'll get another project in before, uh, before Christmas. God bless you now.